Hello, my name is Carlos Aguilar. I work for Cypher Business Solutions. In this video, I'm going to show you how to create a dynamic application studio report using a combo box. With this report, you will have the ability to display values for budget, actual, and variation depending upon the selection of the period from the from the combo box. So let's get to it. Switch to design mode. Enter the report title. Enter the column headers now. I am going to center these titles. Next step, I'm going to incorporate the data to the report. So I have to go now to database structure and select the sales cube and within the sales cube select the product dimension so i'm going to drag it drop it in the report area expand the hyper block just created to include the variation cell next insert the formulas in the budget and actual cells so head over to the toolbar click the OLAP formula button from the OLAP formula button select the budget element of the version dimension so that it corresponds to the budget column so now I have the formula inserted we want to insert the formula for actual click on the OLAP formula button I already have actual selected, so all I need to do is press OK and have my formula inserted. Calculate the variation as budget minus actual, like so. I'm going to fix this truncation. And set the precision to two decimal points like so next step is to incorporate the combo box object select the cell where you want the combo box click the combo box button in the toolbar since this is a time related combo box I'm going to drag and drop the time dimension and drop it on the combo box object like so next step is to get the combo box name double click the combo box this combo box is called list view 2 however i'm going to rename it as lv for list view period that's a good practice click ok now i need to link the combo box with the hyperlink so I need to edit this uh, formula one more time activate the formula press the OLAP formula editor and double click on the time element and from here I need to select the combo box name just created which is LV period click OK and repeat the same steps for the actual cell click the OLAP formula editor double click the time element and select the combo box name like so click OK and that's all you need to do let's run this report so I'm going to select one period I'm going to select period one period two and finally period three and that's how you create a dynamic application studio report using a combo box.
Thank you very much for watching.